Welcome to the Meru National Polytechnic. My name is Mutembe Kigige. I am the principal of the Meru National Polytechnic. Uh, Meru National Polytechnic is situated in Mount Kenya East, uh, where uh, we say uh, that we are the best technical training institution in the region. And um, at the Meru National Polytechnic, we are situated in a serene environment at the border of Mount Kenya Forest, and um, we have clean air, we have clean water, we have uh, the best customer service in the region. We are also very close to the Meru town, which is very, very busy. Um, for those who may not know, Meru town is ranked uh, number four in terms of cash flow. So then uh, we are in a rich region uh, where um, um, the economy is growing very, very fast. At the Meru National Polytechnic, um, we are accredited as a qualifications awarding institution. Uh, Polytechnic now becomes a certificate awarding institution. We offer our own curriculum. We have eight academic departments. We have electrical and electronics department, uh, mechanical and automotive uh, engineering department. We have uh, information and communication technology. We have business. We have agriculture. We have applied sciences. We have institutional uh, management uh, departments. And uh, these departments um, are fully grown and we have a total of about 11,000 uh, trainees and uh, about 270 trainers. We also have about 150 non-academic staff all who serve in the Polytechnic to make it what it is today. At the Meru National Polytechnic, we have other activities which support the uh, academic uh, activities. For instance, we have a very good baby care center for our trainees who are mothers. We also offer that service to the outsiders as well. We have a very robust order center, open and distant uh, learning center which we want to modernize and make the best in the region, not only in the region but in the country. And uh, at the moment we are uh, improving on its acoustics. Uh, we are also improving on the, uh, the equipment. Like for instance now we are in the process of buying the equipment in virtual realities. We also want to establish a media center, which will be the leading media center in the region. And um, we have a, a very uh, good uh, farm, uh, which is in production throughout the year. We produce uh, cabbage, we have uh, onions, we have tomato, we have potato, we have bananas, we have uh, sukuma wiki, uh, we have dairy cows, we have chicken poultry, and uh, we have a piggery, and uh, we uh, uh, supply both the institution and the community around ourselves. In the area of innovations, we have encouraged our students to uh, go for it. And we have seen um, serious improvement. Na pia niseme ya kwamba kutoka hapa Meru National Polytechnic hawa wote wataweza kujiunga na wengine 
eh, kwenda France eh, next year ili waweze kuhusika katika World Skills Competition na watakuwa fully sponsored by the World Skills Competition team. We had uh, three of our projects emerging the best and uh, in the year 2024 in September those projects will be proceeding to France uh, to have the world scale show the world over. We also are very good in uh, Africa Tech Challenge where our students have excelled not only within the country but they have also excelled in the entire East African region and uh, we have several trophies to uh, showcase for what we have been able to achieve in the area of innovation. We have always held number one uh, in the area of uh, uh, robotics and we are happy uh, to be the leading institution in those issues. Uh, definitely we uh, have a collaboration with the uh, Meru uh, County Government and we train their Meru Youth Service students. We offer them courses and unique courses. For instance, the cohort which has just concluded their training, we have offered them uh, courses in uh, home care management, in security management, and in dairy farm management. And all those students or trainees, after we have uh, released them to the market, um, majority of them, over 90%, are already employed two months over and we are also happy to be of that help. Currently, we are engaged with um, Kenya National Highways Authority and um, we want to uh, collaborate in training of um, the youth in the uh, northern region uh, where they are doing the construction, but the World Bank has also offered uh, the aspect of training of the youth along that corridor and uh, we are currently doing a proposal and we are hopeful that we are going to get many uh, youth from that region and we will be able to offer solution to our youth in the region and the country over. National Polytechnic um, has also a very good uh, administration uh, led by the Council of the Polytechnic. Uh, the Council Chair is called Dr. Getambu Jage, uh, a very uh, seasoned man. Uh, we have the principal, we have two deputy principals, one in academics and one in administration. We also have two registrars, one in administration and one in academics. We have the Dean of Students, we have uh, HADA, the Academic Heads of Departments. We are certified under ISO uh, 9001 of 2015. We are now currently pursuing ISO 27000 uh, under Information Security Management Systems. Uh, we also have uh, Industrial Liaison Offices and Quality Offices. And um, we have MOUs with the industry around us and within the country. And the reason why we have done that is because we need to collaborate with the industry to be able to uh, take our trainees for industry engagements and experience so that they can get to know what happens out there in the industry. Besides that, the reason for engaging the industry is because we have currently shifted 100% from the traditional way in which you are offering the curriculum. To make this visible, we want to say that we are producing uh, individuals who are really able to do what they are expected to do. To competence-based education and training. Now, competence-based education and training uh, requires that the industry gets involved in the assessment of the trainees and therefore we need to engage the industry so that they can be part and parcel of the training that the graduates we churn out will be uh, top-notch because they will have had sufficient industry experience out there 
and um, we are happy to have that kind of collaboration with the industry. We have also rolled out a program and today we are concluding training of trainers because our trainers also needed to be retooled so that they depart from the traditional way of delivering curriculum uh, to now uh, a new way of delivering curriculum under the competence-based education and training. And we are glad and grateful to the government and to um, CICAN, Colleges and Institutes Canada, through uh, Kenya School of Tibet, uh, offered to give us that training for our uh, trainers so that they can get retooled and be uh, made ready to be able to handle the new generation of trainees who will be more hands-on than um, being theoretical. We have a driving school uh, which is also very busy. We train students from within and we also uh, train outsiders on driving skills and we have uh, very good instructors. Now we are about also to um, get collaboration with the Meru County government and we extend this collaboration to the secondary schools around because we are establishing a beautiful ultra-modern uh, garage uh, for repairs, maintenance and servicing of the vehicles. Not only for uh, the Meru National Polytechnic but for also other um, uh, customers who are around us who will be willing to uh, do business with us. So then our trainees will also be exposed internally to best practices when it comes to automotive technology. We are also uh, engaged with the county government besides the training of the Meru Youth Service. We are also engaged with them, county government of Meru, and we are indeed very, very grateful to the governor because she has been able to uh, allocate us that one acres of land at Yaki. We are now at Yaki Farm, a farm which has been donated to us by Her Excellency the Governor of Meru County, Kawira Mwangaza. But through the initiative of Yaki Progressive Group. Uh, which is purely for our agriculture and also for training of the agriculture students and um, have also another 10 acres where we do demonstration uh, to the farmers and other organizations including universities have taken up space to be able to uh, showcase what are the current uh, innovations in uh, seeds development and so on so we are happy because of this kind of collaborations The Meru National Polytechnic is also engaged by the World Bank through East Trip, uh, where we have uh, six components. Of course, one of them is construction of a center of excellence in building and civil engineering. Another one is uh, making of curriculum uh, under CBET. Uh, another one is uh, capacity building for both our trainers and management, and of course, our council and uh, the other one is collaboration with other institutions and the industry as well and um, through ESTRIP we have been able to engage because ESTRIP is an East African program uh, with uh, countries like Tanzania uh, and also Ethiopia and uh, we are offering a curriculum uh, from both the East African region uh, countries and therefore we have had 
uh, various collaborations uh, with Tanzania, the Dar es Salaam Institute of Technology and Arusha, Arusha Technical College and others in making common curriculum and also uh, doing dual training with them. Their students have come to Meru and our students have gone there and uh, they have been uh, exposed to what uh, those countries also do and how they do their training. Similarly, we are also engaged with uh, institutions in Ethiopia and uh, the engagements have been very, very fruitful both for our trainers and our trainees. This program is going on and um, it's supposed to end by end of next year 2024 and we are excited about what is happening uh, through the World Bank project. Similarly, we have uh, engaged ourselves with the Canadians through Colleges and Institutes Canada and uh, this is in the area of agriculture. The, uh, we have uh, prepared curriculums together, uh, level 6, level 5 and level 4 in agriculture. They have been of great help because um, besides the curriculum, they have uh, retooled our trainers and they have also given us equipment or tools which will be used. We have enough machinery, we have other things which we need to use uh, for our workshops and so on and we are very grateful to Colleges and Institutes Canada. Similarly, we have, they have uh, uh, taken our trainers to Canada for industry experience, and the principal has also benefited uh, there because uh, uh, we have gone there twice, and we are still headed there in April uh, for more industry exposure, and also to connect. Welcome to the Meru National Polytechnic.